Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Erin. Today, we're going to be watching the new Hellblade 2 Senua's Saga official gameplay trailer. I just had to read that to see what the title said. So Hellblade is a game I played a little while ago on my channel last October, I think. So it's been quite a while. It's such a good game. If you guys haven't played it or haven't seen my series, definitely watch or play it yourself first, I recommend, because it's just really an experience I recommend for people to go in blind because there are twists in the game that are very shocking and I feel like just really hit hard when you realize them. And I'm very, very interested to see what this sequel is going to do for the series. And the other thing is that I was a bit hesitant about covering this or talking about it because I've heard that this will be a Microsoft slash Xbox exclusive. I do not have an Xbox One or Xbox Series X or anything like that. I only have a PlayStation 4. Um, currently, I have my PC, which may be able to play it, but I might have to upgrade a few things before I do that because this game looks very, very um, graphic intensive, labor intensive for my poor little computer. I'm not saying my computer is bad, but it tends to overheat very fast and need to get to replacing the fans on this thing. But that being said, if I can play this game, I very much would like to because I really enjoyed the first one. It was a very, very heavy, heavy experience. I just finished my reaction to Plague Tale uh, Requiem, which is coming out. So, so many trailers dropped yesterday on the 9th that I was not aware of. And I am just very excited to see it. I know a few people want to see my reactions to it. So, you guys got what you wanted. I'm doing it for you guys. So, this. This gameplay trailer is six minutes long. Um, very interesting. I did see uh, the other trailer that came out where it was sort of just Senua doing some chanting and stuff like that. But holy shit, those graphics. It looks like a real person. It looks like just like her voice actress, um, who is also amazing, by the way. She's incredible. I cannot believe Senua's sacrifice was her first ever acting anything that is insane to me she did a phenomenal job so i'm very excited to see what this is going to be like um have no idea what it's going to be like i just am imagining some insane graphics so let's watch this trailer i'm, I'm just very excited i am really nervous anyway let's watch it let's see what's going to go on and she said with our swords, we will forge new stories to strike the gods that haunt us. Oh my god. You might see me as weak, but I will show you what lies behind my eyes. Oh my god! <laughs> the music is something I really liked in the first game too. We will embrace Whoa. our suffering, soothe our scars of grief, and break their siege of our minds. Siege of you our minds. You may see them as gods, but we will show you what lies behind their eyes. Oh my god, she's back! My girl! It's coming. He's here. That's my name. He can smell your fear. What's he say? The voices are back too. It knows our name. How does it know our name? To risk your oh. own life for what you believe is your sacrifice to make. You to lead others to wow. death brings a different kind of burden. Look at that animation! One that Senua would have to learn to bear. Is that Hela? Is she back? We're after more gods, it seems like. So it looks like she's almost leading people. That's crazy. The voices. 
Look at the bones. That's going to be you. That's going to be everyone. Whoa, no, that's not Hella, is it? I like how she's... Whoa. <laughs> That's insane. Those whose eyes are clouded by fear are besieged by the ghosts that haunt them. Senua saw that to win the war we must break this siege. Break it with an unshakable uh, truth. I wouldn't get up. Break it with an oh. impossible feat. I like how brave she is. Ready. She's so calm now. It's so different. Yes. Yes. Whoa. Whoa. Oh. That's not Hella, that's another god, I guess. Let me turn off the subtitles I just realized we're on. Oof. My god. Whoa. Whoa. Oh my god. Oh my god. Is that gameplay? My god! The music too? Yes! Are they trying to lead him out there? Oh wow. Those people are brave. <laughs> Would not be me. Oh, wow. Wow. <laughs> Look at her helping people! Whoa, whoa, whoa! It's me it wants to kill. Yeah, it keeps calling her name! Whoa! Do they have catapults or something? I feel like it would really help. Wow. Whoa. Damn. I wonder who these people are. Oof. It's after her. Help me. What's your name? I know you. He needs you. No. Don't tell me. Don't tell me that was her. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh. What was the name of her lover? What was his name? What's his name? Oh my god, oh my god, I need to look it up, I need to look it up, hold on. Dillian! Dillian, okay, it was, his name was Dillian. Why was I thinking of the name Derek? Oh my god, I, I would have been so embarrassed. Okay, so we know, I don't think that's him, but... No, his face looks nothing like him. But I was just thinking, like... Oh, what if it's his her father? No, I don't know. I don't know, but it's obviously someone that someone knows. I have so many questions. Oh, wow. But just, holy crap. <laughs> She's like, I know you. I know you. And then she cries. So it's obviously someone close to her. But who is it? It's not Dillian. It looks nothing like him. But we did, I mean, at the end of the first game, 
so many I had so many questions at the end of the first game too, but we ended up dropping Dillian's head, which is what we're using to like carry his his soul, his vessel, I think. And uh we sort of let him go at the end. So part of me was like, oh my god, what if that's Dillian and he's back? But no, I don't I don't think so. Wow though, this is crazy. I was right though. Um, looks like it's only available for Xbox Series X or S, um, or Windows, which, if possible, I would love to play this game. I really would. Um, but it might have to be on my PC, which I don't know how my computer can run something like this, because this looks absolutely gorgeous. That did not feel like six minutes. That went by so fast. But these, I, I forget who does the music for this game, but it is so good. I listened to that soundtrack of the first game repeatedly, <laughs> like right after I finished it. I just binged it so much. I do that for most games, but this one especially, so good. It just sets the, the tone of the game perfectly. But can we just appreciate the, the graphics? Soothe our scars of wow. and break their siege of our minds. I'm trying to hear you may see them as gods. But we will show you what lies behind their eyes. So I feel like she's definitely I mean she's obviously part of this army. And I don't know if she leads them or maybe she's helping lead them, but her powers are very much um, helping her with that. I've missed her so much. She's such a badass. I gotta be honest, <laughs> when I saw this, I was like waiting for the gameplay to happen. Does anyone else like have that happen? Like, I was waiting, because when it turned around, I was like, okay, but it still looked like a cinematic. But this is the is gameplay. That's insane. Yeah, so she's leading other people. I gotta listen to what he's saying. To risk your own life yeah. for what you believe is your sacrifice to make. To lead others to death brings a different kind of burden. So she's leading people. That is so cool. I'm so proud of her. Like. I love that you can hear the voices in the trailer too. It's so good. You can hear the deeper voice in the background too. I forget who that is. I think it's Surtur or like her father. It might be her father actually. I don't remember the game extremely well. It has been a while since I played it and I stayed down. Only played it the, the one time on the channel. I didn't go back and replay it. Or if I did, I only played sections of it. I'm just mesmerized by these graphics. Get ready. So good. Wow. Oh my god. That is disturbing though. Man, these games, these games though. These graphics are really, really getting crazy. It keeps it keeps calling after her though. So, like she said, she knows. I just don't really have any theories as to who it could be. I love that you can still hear the voices in the back going, run, run. If that's only one enemy in the game, you know, what else are we going to see? I really, really like that um, there's more people around because the first game was kind of 100% just Senua. <laughs> Um, I mean, we had the enemies and stuff, but when it came to, like, allies, those are kind of just Senua's visions. And, um, a lot of it was real people. Um, I'm pretty sure they, they didn't really have the time or the budget to make models as detailed as Senua for everyone else, so they kind of just used real actors. And that was kind of one thing that I just didn't really like. I... I don't know. Um, I almost would pr would have preferred just their voices um, instead of seeing them like that. It kind of took you out of the experience a little bit because you can tell the difference. I mean, as amazing as the graphics look, 
you'll always be able to tell the difference between an animated person and a real life person. There's just, I don't think, I don't think graphics are quite there yet. As amazing and as detailed as they are and as Senua is, you'll always be able to tell, you know? Um, but for this one, it looks like there's a bunch of people around. And I really like that. But her facial expressions are just insane. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Help me. I know you. But I don't know who that is. Very excited though. I really hope I can play this game. I really, really do. All right, guys, that leaves off this video. I really am so intrigued by this series. It has so much potential. The first game was really good. I feel bad for people who haven't experienced it because the twist at the end of the first one with the rot on her shoulder and all that kind of blew my mind and the ending left me so heartbroken and Senua is such a strong character. I love seeing her progression through the first game. I love seeing um, just her get stronger and learn to accept herself and I hope that we see even more of that progression in this game and you can, al you can already tell how much stronger she is. She's leading an army at this point. She has so much responsibility on her shoulders where beginning of the first game, she was just so defeated and like meek and very unsure of herself and almost scared of herself. Whereas I, I just really like to see her come into her, her own a bit and like use her differences to her advantage. And it seems like she's doing that and I'm just so proud of her and I am very confused by the story. I won't lie. I don't really have any theories as to what could be going on. Um, but either way, very intriguing, very exciting. We have so many amazing games lined up. I don't know when this is going to come out. It just says Hellblade 2 Senua's Saga. So I assume there's probably going to be a third one, right? Um, I don't know. I don't know. But either way. I I'm just I'm very excited. I I really hope I can play this game, guys. Um, but let me know what you guys think. I know a lot of people want to see my reaction to this, and it's so cool. It's so cool. These graphics are just seriously blowing me away. Wow. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, leave a like if you enjoyed. If you want to see more videos like this, please let me know. I love doing them. It's cool going through the video and dissecting it and talking about what I think. Anyways, guys, I will see you all in my next video. Goodbye.